All right, so here's a quick story about a NVIDIA trade that, oh man, I'm just shaking my head each time I think about it, just trying to live with it, but it's all good. It's all good. We all know NVIDIA just skyrocketed from basically the five, up of 500s to now over 800. Well, when that thing was trading about 530, 540, somewhere around there, I bought 24 call spreads that expired January 23rd. Uh, the 820 and the 840 call spreads. I bought 24 of those bad boys. Now each one cost me about, uh, I think it was about 260, right? So fully mature, these things basically I would be able to buy them back at because they're 20 points wide. I'll be able to buy them back at 2000, uh, 20 for basically 2000. I bought them for three, uh, 260, but 24 of those things. All I had to do was hold them. And I think it would have matured. I think it would have uh, been worth uh, $48,000. It was basically a $48,000 trade on, uh, what did that cost me? 5000 $5, maybe? Uh, you have to do the math. Do 20, uh, two, 20, $280 times 24. Let's see, $280 times 10 is 28, times 20 is 36. Yeah, so. Uh, now I'm looking stupid in here. Twenty-eight, fifty-six, <laughs> yeah, something like uh, seven thousand or something like that. It would have been a forty-eight thousand dollar trade if I remember, and uh, I sold it. So when the video just rocketed up to like seven ten, I think I sold seven ten, seven twenty. I sold it. I wanted it to pull back. It pulled back a little bit, but it was only for a day, and it's just already up at eight hundred. I didn't even have time to buy those spreads back. And it's obviously going to be a winning trade because I still have another two years left for the most part on a year and a half for the most part on those positions. And I got rid of them and it's already trading at 8, 10, 8, 15. So an unbelievable trade. Anyway, this is why you want to buy leaps. If you're going to buy anything out of the money, you want to buy leaps when you do that because it gives you time for it to get there. I'm thinking it's going to take two years at most when I put the trade on. It got there in like six months. So imagine if I'd have bought the six months options with that. With oh man, that would have probably been that would have probably cost me fifty cents or something like that. It's unbelievable, but I'm still making good money on the video. I made good money on that trade, and I'm still making good money because I got put spreads, I got call spreads, I got all kinds of spreads still going on. But that was a unbelievable spread. You want to know something else? I, on my other account, I did the same trade, but I didn't do it twenty four times. I did it 50 times. So that was damn near a $100,000 trade. And I sold that. I sold that one months ago, though. Anyway, just a little something. So when I'm talking about in the video all the time, y'all could just think about that story. And be like, oh, man, this dude, I don't f up, man. I f that trade up. <laughs> but I made some money. But it always hurts when you know how much you could have made, right? How much I could have made. And I think about that all the time. You know, you gotta, you got you just gotta keep it moving. Keep trading, keep it moving. All right, there's my story. Dre trades Twitter, Instagram. Peace.